Okay, I'm going to show you how to do the frother. So you have to pump with this about uh, 15, 20 times like this. about 20 already. Actually, you have to keep this one in the special rubber compartment specifically uh -huh. for this thing. So it doesn't move, doesn't fly. Now, so I made the frother in this perfect frother. I'm gonna <clears throat> add it to my cup. And also, actually, I learned the tip. This is a 2% milk, but they suggest a whole milk. So that way you will get a rich frother uh foam but this is two percent because this is all i have right now so i already have my coffee here and you can just pull it out this is removable basket reusable i'm not going to use this one so i pull the cup holder so i already have my coffee here I'm gonna select travel size because it's the this is the bigger <clears throat> cup size, like 10 or 12 ounces. So I'm gonna select the travel and I'm gonna open the drip because before I made my earlier coffee, I stopped the drip, so it stopped dripping. And I click the specialty brew. And it's gonna start brewing in just a few moments. So this is how it is brewing, and it layers up nicely. It's still, the foam is still on top, but then again, before I used the whole milk, it was much thicker, much thicker foam. And so it has the half size of the carafe, the full size carafe, classic brew, rich brew, overized brew, specialty brew, and also has the clean button, so you can clean and drip stop so practically if you close it right now it will stop dripping and is not brewing until you open the drip okay and it should beep when it's done okay and it's really delicious I use it with my coconut palm sugar which makes it such a wonderful sugar substitute and this is the, the water holder, reservoir. You just open it, replace it, fill it up, wash it if you need to, click it, uh, set it in place. This is just, I fell in love with this machine from my first cup of coffee. Oh, now it's beeping. I actually did go out and got a whole milk. I filled it up to here and not up to here and then like see how much froth i have and let's try with this one and it's like so much smoother and richer so it's just done and now you see the big difference that uh, whole milk does this is the coffee right here no this is the milk the coffee layer and the foam layer which is the more, so much smoother and so delicious. Add sugar and it stays like that, foamy. A little bit of cinnamon and the froth stays right on top. I also like about it, it's how compact it is. It may seem huge and bulky, but I just push it on my countertop all the way to the wall when it's not in use and see how much space I still have on my countertop left. Before I used to have another coffee machine which then just like came up until here. It was like taking out the whole entire of my nice countertop so I had to give it to my mother-in-law sadly. So this one really looks nice on my countertop. Thank you for watching.